So this is uh, just before food time. Um, we've had a few things happen in this tank. Um, I have taken my big male um, rainbow fish out, my Australian rainbow fish. His sores were not healing. It's just too big a tank to try to put stuff in to heal him. So he's in a Tangaran now and he's doing quite well at the moment. Um, just my little tetra I put in. He's just come out of hiding. Um, my black widow, I know you just call them black skirted tetras. In the UK we call them black widows. He's um, quite bossy. He does like chasing the bigger fish around but he doesn't nip things so that seems to be fine. He spends most of his time playing in the um, in the water flow. Um, it's like he's at an amusement park. So he's a quite nice looking fish. He was very bedraggled. They he had um, he was in a, a tank with some different fish who had been biting his fins. Um, he has no interest in Victor. That's always my biggest thing here that nobody goes for Victor's fins and he has no interest in Victor at all. He will chase the rainbows about and he will chase the other um, tetras. But um, he doesn't seem to have any interest in Victor at all. Victor's still looking charming. He's such a beautiful fish. So um, I've been finding the last lot of uh, baby guppies that were born in here that have managed to make it to um, a fair size. They're very, very tiny fish. Um, you look against some of the other fish, the new babies are very, very small, which I quite like. I think I can get more of the guppies in the tank and my females are starting to come out quite pretty. I've been trying to breed out the plain yellow guppies to more um, different colours. So the females and the males are usually not much different in colour. But the males are quite tiny. If I am going to keep um, breeding stock of guppies, I'm going to have to start introducing some new females. I have some new females who are not anything to do with the fish that are in here. Just so I've got some new blood. I do love these half and half tails. I've got quite a few of those. And they do look quite unusual when you see them in the tank. It seems I've got a couple of females that are the same kind of design. I do find if I have um, guppies born in this tank, they do take a long time before I actually see them. Uh, I suppose they spend most of their time hiding when, they, when they're very young. It does take quite a while. This is why I thought I'd film them today to see what kind of males I've got because they do come out for feeding. Um. So hopefully my big male rainbow fish will be back in this tank in another week or two. When I first turned the tank on in the morning, both of my um, turquoise rainbow fish are actually black. They're coal black. And then they gradually go lighter during the day. 